Republicans don't appear to think too highly of higher education, and that's an issue that's dividing the country. According to a survey from the Pew Research Center, almost 60% of Republicans and Republican-leaning independents say that higher education has a negative effect on the country. For Democrats and Democrat-leaning independents, that percentage is less than 20%. Pew says this data shows a dramatic shift in viewpoints. Just two years ago, a majority of Republicans and Republican leaners saw higher education in a positive light. By 2016, the viewpoints were more split, and now the majority is negative. Some experts say this could be happening because of the rising costs of higher education combined with the difficulty of finding postgraduate employment. With this in mind, some people are seeing colleges and universities as less valuable than they used to. Another more popular explanation, higher education is perceived as inherently liberal. One expert even told the Chronicle of Higher Education that college is seen as a quote, production facility for democratic beliefs. Conservative media outlets have been quick to criticize campus culture as coddled and a threat to free speech. Going beyond just how these diverging viewpoints are forming, statistics from the 2016 presidential election show that the split on education is also having an effect on politics. A report from 538 found that Hillary Clinton did best in highly educated counties, while Donald Trump soared in the least educated ones. It concluded that education levels were the critical factor in predicting who would vote for Trump.